lovelies, welcome to my channel. It is full moon tonight, so what can we do? This is an easy, very effective spell. This is a spell that is known as the white bath, baño blanco. Um, and what it's for, it is to completely release yourself from any type of negative energy to cleanse yourself, but it also assists you in removing any kind of candle magic, anything that has been sent your way, that has been put on you without your permission, this spell is for you. Now, it's not just as a cleansing, but it is also, with the few other elements we're going to be using, it is also to open the doors, whether it's to love, whether it's to abundance, to success, whatever it is that your heart is seeking at this point in time. Very effective, like I said, and it's very easy. Perhaps you guys have most of the ingredients. Now, like I said, this is preferably done on a full moon or a new moon um, because of the energy that you want to assist you in this process to be the strongest possible, which would be a full moon, and as well as the energy of the new moon, which is bringing to you new beginnings. So again, you can do it on a full moon through the waxing phase going towards the full moon or a new moon as well. What do we need? It's very simple. As you guys can see here, we have water. You're going to be using some water. doesn't matter the type of water you're going to be using. We need some cinnamon. You need a plastic container where you can put the water because you are going to be using this for three nights. It is a three-day ritual. So preferably a plastic container where you can put it and keep it refrigerated when you go to shower, uh, you would use this. And again, like I said, you can put it back in the refrigerator, use it the next night and so on. You're also going to be needing some coconut milk. It could be any type of coconut milk. You're also going to be using cascarilla, which is basically the eggshells. Now, if you don't have these, you can, if you don't have a botanical shop or somewhere near you where you can get cascarilla, you can always make it on your own by using the egg shells from the eggs, um, powdering it to a powder base and using that. Um, it has the same effect. It is, like I said, powerful. Uh, it is used, it has always been used for protection as well as to ward off any negative energy. Um, primarily practitioners use it before and after spell work uh, to cleanse themselves and to bring protection uh, to them. Now, we're also going to be integrating some cinnamon uh, essential oil. If you don't have cinnamon essential oil, you can always stick to the powder, okay? And depending on the type of deity or the type of um, spirits that you're going to be working with, I do all my workings for, for protection uh, through my Saint Saint Simon. So that's the reason why I have the puro, uh, the cigar, and um, it's basically to increase and empower. I'm doing this for a client that's gonna be picking up uh, this white bath for them. So again, I figured I might as well record it, put it up for you guys. I know that I've been lagging on spell work. We just have tons of work that is being done and a lot of it um, is heavy work. So uh, when it comes to ceremonial rituals, that's obviously something I cannot show you guys. Um, but I am going to be more proactive in uploading videos for spell work, depending on different types of spell work. Anyways, now this is the main ingredient that we're going to be using. When I say main, this is to empower. Now you don't need a key. Um, it's not necessary. It's not something that you can't do if you don't have this. However, I highly encourage you guys to get yourselves um a key because it is very powerful and it is like i said not only a cleansing bath but we want to ritualize it for um success so that's the reason why we're going to be using a key as you guys know when it comes to spell work keys are always used to unlock or lock certain things so we're going to be using it to unlock the doors um, of success and abundance for my clients. So let's get to the nitty gritty, my lovelies. Like I said, you're going to be needing water, the cinnamon essential oil. If you don't have that, you can use the powdered version, uh, a 
plastic container, somewhere, a bowl that you're gonna be using to put all the ingredients and the key. And depending, like I said, who you're working with, I myself am going to be working through St. Simon, so I have his cigar, all right? All right, let's get to the nitty gritty and uh, let's begin. Okay, my lovelies, sorry about all the smoke. As you can see, I've already lit my cigar for my saint. And we're going to begin by introducing the key into the key into the bowl. Okay, I hope you guys can see there. And I'm going to consecrate it and bless it for my client. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, I bless and consecrate. I empower, empower this key so that it can become a universal key, opening the doors of success and abundance. I bless and empower it. St. Simon, I ask you to be present, to be present in this empowerment and this spell that is about to begin to bring to them abundance and success wealth and prosperity opulence and abundance you're going to place it in the bowl now if you're working with saint simon we use the cigar to cleanse and to purify as well as to empower okay i'm going to set it to the side all right now if you guys know about cigars they're very strong so <clears throat> be patient with me all right here we go we're going to introduce the water In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, I bless and consecrate and empower the water so that it may serve as a cleansing element, so that it may serve and empower my to bring to them success, abundance, to be a universal key that opens and unlocks the doors to abundance, to success, to wealth, prosperity, and protection. We're going to introduce the milk. Okay. And we are going to turn it in a clockwise position with the key. Spirits of abundance, spirits of protection, of opulence, of abundance and success. Okay, once that is done, we're going to be introducing the cascarilla, the eggshell. Like I said, you guys, it is very important that when doing this work, when beginning, you put all your energy, focus, and power into this. Okay, once that is done, what we're going to do is we're going to continue going in a clockwise position to empower strengthen and I'm gonna add some of the I'm gonna add some of the cinnamon essential oil like I said if you guys don't have essential oil uh, you guys can this is the part where you would put some of the cinnamon powder okay and we're gonna turn 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 I wish you guys can smell this.
Put all your energy, your effort into doing this. Feel it all around you. What you're going to do is once this is done, you're going to put it in the plastic container and you're going to little by little, an advice would be like four inches every bath. And you're going to do this for three consecutive nights. You're going to wash yourself with this waters from your neck down, cleansing yourself and welcoming abundance into your life or welcoming love or whatever it is that you're doing this for. After the third night, the spell is done. So again, when doing this, put all your intention, effort and energy towards it. You guys will be amazed at the results that you see. If you guys do in fact do this spell, definitely comment back. Come back, I mean, comment back. Come back to the channel and comment below. Let us know what was your experience. I wanna wish you guys all the best brightest of blessings on this full moon and till then i'll see you guys soon bye